The only solution to conserve nature is to create a conscious planet. That is, every one of us is a conscious existence. What conscious existence means is that we are not engrossed with our own thought and emotion. We are involved with life. It's all right to be overwhelmed by the life process, but it is not all right to be overwhelmed by your own mental and emotional process. Your psychological drama should not overwhelm you, you should be the director of your drama. But the larger life that's happening here is such a fantastic phenomena, which we are destroying at a pace which is criminal, nothing short of criminal. If we go like this, uh, when nature responds or reacts to the level of damage we are doing to this planet, especially soil, the way we are destroying the soil in the world, if we continue and do not take any conscious action, then when the nature reacts or responds, that response is not going to be in our favor. That is going to be disastrous for human communities. Already many signs of this are happening all over the place. Climate change reactions are happening at various levels. You are hearing many disasters happening around the world, but it will be child's play compared to what could happen in the next fifteen, twenty years if we just continue like this with unconscious, compulsive, Activity, human activity, which is just going on unbridled, it's time, it is time. We made this a uh, conscious process, we run our economies in a conscious manner, we build businesses in a conscious manner, we elect governments in a conscious manner, we make policies in a conscious manner. This needs to happen. Conscious planet is the requirement of the day. This is not the requirement of future generations, this is the requirement of the day. The only way we can make this happen is that human beings have to be conscious because that is the only problem we have. Unconscious, compulsive activity from the human species is destroying every other species. Let's make this happen.